The rotunda at the University of Virginia was designed by Thomas Jefferson as the architectural and academic heart of his community of scholars, or what he termed an academical village. Completed in 1826, the rotunda embodied Jefferson's vision for democracy, freedom of religion, and his notions of a new architecture for a new nation. The building's magnificent dome room housed the library for the new university, transforming the rotunda into Jefferson's temple of knowledge while reflecting his belief in the preeminence of learning. Today, the rotunda serves as the symbol of Mr. Jefferson's university and is being revitalized to serve as a site for modern learning. The rotunda is the only World Heritage Site at a United States university and welcomes more than 100,000 visitors each year. Well, here we are on the grounds of the University of Virginia. I'm Peter Ona. I've been teaching history here for almost a quarter of a century. And we're going to be doing a course on the age of Jefferson. And what a treat to be here at Mr. Jefferson's University. We'll be talking about Jefferson's career, his thought. In many ways, this university campus, what we call the grounds, the academical village, is a wonderful representation of who Jefferson was. And we're making our way to the rotunda, which is the heart of Mr. Jefferson's university. You'll notice that the rotunda is, uh, well, it looks classical, or we'd say neoclassical. Yeah, I mean, it's not a chapel. All colonial colleges in Jefferson's time had uh, chapels, were the central thing. So the, he's making a big statement, and the rotunda is a place where lots of important things are happening. It's, it's where the library used to be. It's really the heart of the university. It's a wonderful place to talk about Jefferson, needless to say. So welcome to Thomas Jefferson's world. It's going to be an interesting ride, and you'll be sure to wear your helmet. <laughs> 